my name is Sharon Brown, and um, I'm the caregiver for my mother, who was diagnosed with Alzheimer's uh, in 2001. She was age 67. I had been married for five years at the time, and um, I thought it was going to be a time that I did not want to burden my new husband, so I really actually considered divorce. But in conversation with him, he's in it for the long haul, thank goodness for that, because he's been my rock throughout this entire ordeal. My mother uh, has declined over the years, and um, one thing I learned was to try to make them as comfortable and secure and safe in whatever phase of the Alzheimer's disease that they're in and try to let them be as independent as they possibly can. So I felt like my job was to have the net underneath her, for lack of a better description of it, so that she can be out there, feel independent, because she's always been an independent person, and then be there in the event that she would stumble and fall. I would be there to keep her from hurting herself. So that seemed to work out well um, for her at this point. She has declined to the point where she doesn't talk much, um, but she still is very alert, which is excellent. So I accept her at the point where she is now, and we are able to communicate. If I keep my words down to four at a time, she can actually still respond. So I'm pleased about that. So a word of advice to families that are out there and, and they suspect that their loved ones have uh, this disease is to meet them where they are, not to try to bring them to where we want them to be or where we think they should be. Just accept them for where they are and uh, go from there.